I could not have gotten where I am today without the tireless efforts of the staff and faculty. One thing that becomes immediately clear when beginning studies in the science, engineering, and math departments here at Montgomery College is the high level of excellence maintained by these exceptional individuals. They're experts in their fields, and they are happy and willing to donate as much time and effort as necessary to make sure their students come away with the best possible education. And now, with the opening of the Rockville Science Center, the faculty, staff, and students have a workplace that matches that level of excellence. From the state-of-the-art equipment to the beautiful design, this building breathes new life into the campus. Today, we are a major step closer to creating a cutting-edge, multi-building science, engineering, and math complex. Today, we are a major step closer to living up to the prestige of being the largest community college engineering program in the country. Located on the south side of campus, the Rockville Science Center is now home to the Chemistry, Physics, Biology, Engineering, and Geosciences departments. The 140,000 square foot instructional building provides much needed space for the ever increasing number of students seeking a high quality education in these areas. With its dramatic four story atrium, the building houses gleaming new state of the art laboratories, especially appointed for each field of study. Plenty of classrooms, faculty offices allowing professors to stay close to where they teach, and of course, places to study and hang out. Designed to achieve LEED Gold certification, it is cost-effective and eco-friendly as well as educational at every turn. A high-performance building envelope passively controls the environment, reduces cooling, improves occupant comfort, and uses natural daylight to reduce power consumption. In fact, the Science Center is expected to save approximately 40% in annual energy and utility costs over more traditional buildings. You can't miss this enormous ceiling fan, which helps circulate air throughout the open atrium, reducing the need for around-the-clock cooling. The low E glass throughout the building contributes, keeping heat inside during the winter and out on those hot summer days. This series of passive solar shading devices allows daylight to enter, but provides shade when the sun is at its highest. Energy-saving fluorescent and LED lighting is available when natural light isn't enough. And daylight and occupancy sensors control lighting and air conditioning throughout the building. With hundreds of spaces across four stories, maintaining efficiency is no simple task. Air quality, temperature, plumbing, and the laboratory environmental systems are monitored and controlled by this high-tech control system. Here, the college can quickly identify minor problems, failures, and inefficiencies anywhere in the building. Designed as a living laboratory, this building provides learning opportunities for more than science students. Through these open ceilings, architecture, construction, and green technology students can easily study the building structure, ductwork, wiring, and plumbing. On the outside, this rain garden and landscaping allow rainwater from surrounding hard surfaces to soak into the ground, minimizing runoff and erosion. Water can also drain into the stormwater management pond through here. A fixture on the Rockville campus for years, the pond has been enlarged and improved to meet new regulations and to help reduce the environmental impact of stormwater and runoff on the surrounding area. For students, the pond can be a hands-on laboratory for subjects like botany and biology. Instructors can now hold classes on the specially designed dock or from one of the grassy shore areas. Nearby, the greenhouse boasts eco-friendly climate control and plenty of space for students to work. And finally, we take you to the roof where green technology is most visible. The building's green or living roof covers about a quarter of the surface. It provides added insulation and absorbs rainwater to reduce runoff. This 25 kilowatt array of solar panels converts sunlight into electricity, reducing electrical consumption from the power company by about 1%. Also on the roof, we find a brand new observatory 
which is equipped with several telescopes and even has a retracting roof. We leave you with perhaps the most interesting thing we saw at the Rockville Science Center, water filtration by reverse osmosis. Water is purified in this room and collected by this large tank. We've turned the lights out here so you can see the water moving inside the tank. This purified water can now be used in labs throughout the building.